Welcome. My name is Mark Weinzimmer, and this is an SBA Studio walkthrough, part six, the big finale. Today, in our last video, we're going to talk about drill through reports. Creating a drill through report has never been easier. You start by running the guide, and this allows the ability to get data from external sources. In the context tab, you're going to have the name as well as define your intersections. We've picked the measures dimension, specifically our parent and child member, and the scenario dimension in the scenario member. We're going to move on to the report contents tab, where you pick the report type. We've chosen relational, but you can also choose URL or Java. And then you choose your relational column, and we've picked amount. You can see the SQL here. Change it if you'd like, save it. And then move on to the associations tab, where you associate the SBase model, click save, and close. Once you've done that, you can log into Excel, access Smart View, and start your ad hoc reporting. Drill down to level zero members, double click on one of your numbers, and a new spreadsheet will open up with transactional detail. It's a very cool feature. It's very helpful, and I highly recommend it.